Asimo and Bad CC have just released a new robbery and it looks absolutely freaking ridiculous, okay? We don't know too much about the robbery, but we know enough as to like, you know, what it's gonna be, the mechanisms and like what vehicles are allowed, how it generally works, okay? But we don't know like the uh, cash it's gonna give, where we turn it in, and uh, that stuff, okay? So uh, yesterday we mentioned that there's gonna be a buzzard helicopter at the uh, top of this bank here. And if I come down over here, you guys can see, here's the picture of what the buzzard helicopter looks like. It's going to be chilling at the roof of the bank here. That's why they added a ladder here so you can climb to the roof of the bank and you have yourself a helicopter. Now the buzzard helicopter is, uh, it's like the one in Mad City, but it's like actually a real life helicopter that they're based off of. I mean, let's be honest here. Video games copy cars like all the time. It's nothing to be shocked and like, you know, try to cancel the game for, okay? But yeah, we're gonna have a buzzard on here. So that way, you know, helicopters aren't, you know, at a key card wall here. And there aren't like a crazy cash wall, like a million cash on the army heli. I'm thinking this helicopter is going to be like 100,000, 250,000, something like that amount of cash, but uh, it shouldn't be too expensive. And you might be asking, why do you not want the helicopter to be that expensive? Well, you know, one thing that helicopters can do, but the UFO cannot, is UFO cannot drop rope. And you might be wondering, why is rope like so useful now? I mean, I know it's like useful to like rope into the joy store in the museum as a police officer, but that thing needs to be patched to see more bad CC. Uh, yeah, but anyway, speaking of the rope, if you guys have seen the new robbery trailer, you guys will know what is going on with the rope, okay? So, you know, right now we use the rope to like attempt to glitch into the jewelry store. I'm gonna see if I can replicate it right here. Boom. <laughs> I know that is like the most common use case for the rope right now. Well... If we come back over here and watch the cargo boat robbery, this is gonna be good. Alright, let's go ahead and play this thing. So you can see over here, we have ourselves a boat. This boat looks very close to that leak I did that day. And there's also, if I scrub forward here a little bit, you can see right here, we have a turret on the boat. That makes sense now. All right, we had the leak of a boat and a turret. And we were like, you know, maybe it could be a military base. Maybe it could be something else. It turns out it's like a hybrid of a cargo boat and a destroyer. I don't know why a cargo boat would have a freaking turret on it. But for some reason, this boat does. Okay, and then once it comes over here, he shoots you down. And if you get shot down, your helicopter starts beeping. All right, you can see over there, that is like a Simo's uh, helicopter beeping. I think this is, you know, that's a Simo right here. And then uh, here's a uh, bad CC or someone else's helicopter. No, this is a Simo again. He got a new helicopter. His old one, you know, started like falling down. That's bad CC in the police officer team. But basically, you come over here and you dangle a rope onto a crate <laughs> this is similar to the crane theory i had okay except that the boat doesn't dock it just goes around the map and that is very interesting this robbery already looks so cool okay and then you literally have the towing crate like it's just gonna flail around in midair as you fly it somewhere across the map okay and that's all we know <laughs> that is very interesting indeed this robbery is freaking sick Okay, if you guys thought that cargo plane was amazing, or if you guys thought museum was amazing back when it released, dude, this thing looks like so freaking ridiculous. It's actually a tough robbery because it's actually like some form of an NPC against it. It's not just like an obby. I mean, technically, it's not really an NPC eater, but like, you know, it's like an active, you know, heat seeker missile type thing rather than a stationary dumb laser in the jewelry store. It's not like Creek's gonna like avoid oofing in the uh, jewelry store lasers anyway. But anyway, I think that robbery is still really cool. Okay, let's take a look at like some more details here if Asimo and Bad CC have replied. Okay, so Asimo is the one that replied on the uh, Twitter here. So let's take a look at his replies, okay? Creek apparently wants people to get smacked with the crates. Which I'm gonna tell you this, okay? If you've ever watched the Creecraft jailbreak livestream, you know he hates one thing. Well, actually two things. Helicopter bombs and helicopter missiles. He hates them. And you know like whose idea was for uh, those to be added? Creek's idea. Yeah, every like thing he wants, he eventually ends up complaining about it. So I have a feeling, you know, he's gonna be like, let's smack people with the crate. And guess what happens? Some troll is gonna grab a crate, fly to Creek on a live stream, and whack him. 
And uh, yeah, might make players ragdoll and take damage if they get clunked by a freaking crate thing of a jig. <laughs> yeah, Creek's gonna instantly regret getting that. <laughs> new helicopter's not set up yet, they're still scripting that thing. And uh, it's available for a new helicopter and anything with a rope. Okay, and the uh, turn into place is an addition to an existing map location. I wonder where that could be. I feel like the uh, turn in money place is probably going to be this uh, cargo station here. Okay, it's probably gonna, you know, drop it down here. Maybe we're gonna have like a cargo depot, cut down these mountains, blow them up with some TNT or something, and have like a cargo depot over here. That is probably where we're gonna like load stuff. Or the criminal base here, okay? I mean, you see all these crates here? I feel like, you know, a shipping yard. This is definitely, it's like a railroad station. Maybe the train station could be upgraded. It's gonna be like, you know, either this uh, cargo port, the criminal base, or the train station. One of those three locations. I doubt it's anywhere else because, uh, like, nowhere else really has a, you know, cargo thing. I'm not sure if the uh, boat's gonna actually come in the map, though, because, you know, the bridge over here can go up and down. But, you know, that's the boat, and it looks pretty much identical to that. Asimo also mentioned that uh, UFOs probably won't be able to do it, but he might add invisible ropes and looking like, you know, abducting things. <laughs> that, oh man. <laughs> Imagine just flying around here like this, and then there's just like some random guy flying underneath you, and it looks like he's freaking no clipping. I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna do that with like the UFO if he does add that feature. And whatever he does, I'm just gonna hold onto the rope, fly around the map with someone else in the pilot seat, and just, you know, see how many people report me for no clip or fly hacking or whatever. <laughs> that, that's just, yeah, I swear, there's gonna be way too many complaints that people are gonna look like they're hacking. <laughs> okay, let's get on back over here. Uh, it took us 12 takes to finally rob a crate. Really difficult at first. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, man. I, I, I hope I don't go oof in the first one. Because, you know, you're going to be, like, flying like this with the uh, rope down. And the boat's going to be, like, probably driving in a circle around the map like it does right now. And you're going to have to come down over here, dip really low. And you got to, like, uh, you know, zigzaggy, jukey, jukey the uh, helicopter anti-aircraft missiles. And then you have to like cling onto a thing and then start flying away, okay? Hope that that thing does not, you know, clunk you. Hopefully it doesn't clunk me, alright? I don't want to die from that thing. <laughs> I, I hope uh, it's not too hard, but like I want it hard, okay? Just not like, you know, RPO train event, super rare RNG type, ridiculously frustrating hard. That's not the type of heart I want. I want it like once you master, you, like you can't really master. You just gotta like know a technique and then like uh, that works most of the time. But yeah, he actually might add police involvement. Dude, imagine if the boat spawns and all the cops just get teleported on the boat. That would be bonkers. I doubt that's gonna happen. But imagine just having the entire server of police officers just get teleported to the boat and like, you know, shoot down the helicopters as they come in. <laughs> Okay, also if a crate lands in the water, it gets yeeted. So that's why, you know, that helicopter uh, anti-aircraft missile, if you get shot, it's game over, okay? It's not like, you know, you can just fall down and continue. That would be easy, okay? No easy stuff, okay? Rocket launchers can shoot you down. And if the crate, you know, if you fly too low or if you get shot down, you get yeeted. So yeah, this is still very early footage, so there might be, like, more changes here. But yeah, let's go ahead and go uh, back to the Batimo page. So speaking of like, uh, you know, uh, ropes and uh, towing crate stuff. Remember back in the day, alright, two years ago when they first added the army helicopter. You could like daisy chain army helis together and it would be the funniest and wackiest thing ever. Sadly, a SIMO bad CC removed it like two weeks later. Man, I only wish that was a thing. I, I wish that was, okay? You know how many stupid helicopters I tow away from the top of the museum using that thing? At least a thousand. Alright, I really don't like stupid helicopters on the top of the museum. It's just not good. So, yeah, that's why I really wish you could have, like, towing vehicles back. Or maybe that's a secret feature coming this update. Because he did say it was going to be more than just a robbery. It might be, like, some secret features as well. So, this is going to be real good. Really, really, really good, okay? I'm really hyped for this update. Like, Asimo did promise on a thing that that robbery would have nothing to do with any of the current ones. I didn't see a single E circle in there. I saw no punching boxes. And uh, there wasn't any, like, standing of vaults either, okay? 
You are sitting in a helicopter, flying around, grabbing a rope, yeeting it to like some random location, presumably the cargo port or the criminal base, because they were flying towards that direction. But yeah, this robbery is exciting, alright? Let me know in the comment section down below. You guys better be hyped for this thing, because Mad City can't come close to this thing. Have you seen Mad City's cargo boat? <laughs> that thing's a joke compared to this, alright? This thing's a freaking like beast. It is an like actual robbery, okay? It's not like Mad City were to clone the bank five times and put it on a different robbery in Avi set just to make it different. That's not really making a difference, okay? <laughs> but anyway, this is really an amazing robbery, okay? This boat has nothing to do with the Mad City boat. Don't say Mad City copy jailbreak. Don't say jailbreak copy Mad City. You know what freaking jailbreak copy jailbreak? Say that, all right? I don't care. That's a literal meme at this point. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, I guess uh, if you guys enjoyed this, uh, taking a look at the new jailbreak robbery. Man, oh man, am I excited for this thing. I cannot wait to, you know, start uh, clunking some boxes. Uh, hopefully that feature gets added. <laughs> I'm going to be streaming this, like, uh, Saturday night, whenever they're testing, pretty much the entire time. So make sure you guys are liked and subscribed and turn on notifications so you don't miss that stuff. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to press like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comment section down below your, like, uh, reaction to this robbery. What you think the new secret thing is going to be. Do you think Asimo is going to add some of the uh, stuff that he wants to add? And yeah, use star code BACON when you buy Robux or Premium. And I will see you guys next time.